You're watching Fox Saturday Baseball. As the Expos entertain the Mets, and Jeff Torborg and John Rooney have the call. Oh, <laughs> sweet. <laughs> As the 96 season began, many anxiously wondered what course the Montreal Expos would chart. But in his typical fashion, manager Felipe Alou has exhibited his unique ability to maximize the talent at his disposal. Encouraging, teaching, and developing a fundamentally sound ball club. Led by Felipe's son, Moises Alou, the Expos are hoping to make a serious run at postseason play for the first time since 1981. for Saturday afternoon baseball. And Dallas Green has played to smile about as his Mets are winning. They're trying to make it three in a row today as the New York Mets come calling on the Montreal Expos inside Olympic Stadium in Montreal. And as the fans file in for the game today, we'll check the standings in the East where the Braves are leading the Expos by four. The New York Mets are five games away from break even. They're 12 games behind the Atlanta Braves. A very pleasant good afternoon to you, along with Jeff Torborg, I'm John Rooney. With these Montreal Expos, Jeff, they have been a team that has been winning in the 90s, yet they haven't been able to make the playoffs. They did have the best record in baseball in 1994. But when you check out the teams with the best winning percentages in the 90s, the Braves have won a world championship, the White Sox have won a division title, Cincinnati has won a world championship, and the Expos are still trying to get there. Well, it's amazing to me, John, that they're even competitive. After the 94 season, they lost two all-star outfielders, two all-star pitchers, but I think Felipe Alou, their manager, keeps them alive. Their farm system seems to continue to produce. They've made some smart trades, and they keep the, they continue to be competitive. Oh, well, deal with the Dodgers brought Henry Rodriguez over. He's going to the All-Star game, and here is Mark Grizzolanik, and he's going to be going to the All-Star game as well. That's great for both these guys. Young Grizzolanik going his second year. Henry Rodriguez wasn't real happy getting traded over here, and now he's producing. It's great for this ball club to see these guys take up where the other people have left off. When you were managing the Mets, the Mets didn't do a very good job of catching the baseball, but they're pretty strong up the middle. Todd Hundley played for you there, and Lance Johnson played for you while with the White Sox. Yeah, they did. No, we didn't do very well when I was managing them, but these two guys have really <laughs> stepped up for this ball club, and Lance Johnson's an all-star now, as we say, and was an outstanding player in the American League. Todd Hundley has worked so hard to get to where he is, and he has become a leader of this ball club, and they are strong up the middle and really coming as a ball club. Let's take a look at the pitchers for today's game. On the mound for the Montreal Expos, Kirk Reeder. He's 5-5 five five with a 402 ERA. And Bobby Jones, 7 up, 5 down, a 4.63 earned run average, will make the start for the Mets. And we're just a couple of days away from the All-Star game, so get set for baseball. And we'll be back to Montreal after these messages from your local Fox station. You're watching Fox Saturday Baseball.